today I've got Raven in the halter for her very first time. I'm gonna see what I can get done today, but I'm hoping she'll be leading by the end of the session, even if not perfectly. I'm also trying to do this before the storm rolls in. Right now I can hear some thunder in the distance and I'm not sure if it will pass over us. I didn't see it in the forecast, so hopefully it won't be here. Let's get to work. All right guys, so this video is going to be a little bit different because I lost most of my footage from this day. Watch the backstory video if you want answers as to why. Thankfully, to be able to tell this story, I was able to pull some clips from conversations I had had with friends. I kid you not, I spent 20 minutes scrolling back in a conversation I had had with my friend Marina in order to get some audio clips. So bear with me as I try to put this story together. Now Raven is a wild Mustang that I recently adopted and have just started the gentling process using positive reinforcement. Once the halter's on, I usually switch over to negative reinforcement. I described these terms in my last video, but basically it just means that today I'm going to be introducing the lead line and teaching her how to yield off pressure on the halter. So I'm now going to a pressure and release style of training. So right here was the last of the content that I had saved on my hard drive. So we're gonna now move over to WhatsApp. When I first got the halter on Raven, I sent my friend Marina these messages. I had wanted to get the halter on Raven today, but I wasn't sure if it would actually happen. And sure enough, it did. So I decided to take it from there. It was actually a perfect day for this as I had the whole day that I knew I'd be able to dedicate towards Raven. So I attached the lead line and we started introducing pressure on that line. The first session was just under an hour and she did so well. Oh my goodness, I couldn't believe it. We took another break and then I headed out again. I did two other sessions before sending Marina another message and you won't believe what it was. Yep, we got the saddle on. I could not believe it. Before saddling, I worked on lunging, direction changes, yielding the hindquarters, yielding the forequarters, backing up, oh, and fly spray. It was mind blowing considering I had just introduced the halter this morning. Being so freaking good, like it was so easy to sh saddle her. I was like being all skittish and scared and <laughs> trying to get out of her space, but she like just didn't even care. I am so glad that she was not my first Mustang because she would have totally distorted my view of Mustangs. <laughs> she's so good. Like literally just like she's completely blossoming with every session and like literally every minute. She's, she is like a dream. Like this is like what you kind of hope for. The, like the talk about a breakthrough. Like she's like, it's light bulb, ding, 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 whatever. <laughs> oh, I hope this is going to be a good video. I mean. Yeah, I'm, I'm like trying to figure out how am I gonna, like I'm already planning my head, like how am I going to do this? Cause this is a lot. It's pretty funny listening to that because I had no idea that I would lose all my content. Wow, what a day, what a day. It's amazing what, um, what she got done in a few hours. I'm like in disbelief. Yeah, she went from first time haltering, first time even touching the halter to yeah halter on pressure release lunging direction changes yielding the hindquarters yielding the forward quarters backing up i put the sir single on her i put the saddle pad on her the saddle a circle driving fly spray and she ended with a bath <laughs> it's just like what oh my gosh what a lucky draw all right, so that was the backstory on Raven. Completely blew my mind. That morning, she had not yet even touched a halter. We went from targeting the halter to putting the halter on to continuing through teaching um, how to her how to lead, how to lunge, how to change directions, all those different things, how to yield the hindquarters, yield the quarters. We put the saddle put on, the sur single, the saddle, fly spray, her first bath. It was mind-blowing <laughs> so and of course the day that I do all that stuff is the day that I lose all that footage again I have a whole video where I explain the whole story I just didn't want to throw that here but uh yeah she's an incredible horse clearly I do love that when I first got her she was pretty fearful and did have a pretty big personal space bubble and it was really just rewarding to earn her trust and yeah it just 
when she, when it clicked for her that day I got the tag off when it clicked for her it's like it really clicked and it really set the foundation for all of this stuff to happen so um, yeah it was a really monumental day but that's my story I am so sorry that I lost all that footage believe me I could have made like I don't know how many videos I would have made out of that day but it was so much content um, but Oh well, it's in the past, so <laughs> moving forward from here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.